Hello YouTubers, New Time Travel Behind Me 88 here. I'm back with a brand new video. And today I'm going to show you guys my VHS and DVD update for September 8th, 2015. I went to Value Village Thrift Store in Baltimore County. I got one clamshell tape, two VHS slip covers, plus one one tape that a friend of mine at work gave it to me and three DVDs. So there are lots of movies to go through. Let's get started. Start off with a clamshell tape. The first VHS that I picked up is a 1997 VHS of Wild in America. This is loosely based off on a true story of the Stauffer brothers, Marty, Mark, and Marshall. And they have an idea to spend a summer vacation that will turn to eventual lifetime. Now, for those of you who aren't familiar about the show Wild America, it's a nature documentary that airs on PBS from 1982 to 1997. So, um, here's the front, the spine, and the back. And let me pull the tape out and show you guys tape for Wild in America. Has the ink label. And the print date is September 19th, 1997. Okay, so uh, that's the 1997 VHS of Wild America. Alright, next tape I'm going to show you guys. It's a 1990 MCA home video VHS of Duel. This is the second movie that Steven Spielberg directed it. And stars Dennis Weaver as a business travelsman who getting chased by this um, psychopathic driver of the truck. Now, the movie is originally as a May of movie of the week that was aired on ABC back in 1971. But after realizing Steven Spielberg added new footage and it was originally running time was 71 minutes. But they added new footage on here so they put it the running time of 92 minutes. So this is a great one. I only saw bits and pieces that was aired on Universal Story. Here's the front, the spine, that was spine, the top, and the back. And here's the tape look like for Duel with the sticker label. And checked out this weird label. No end label and no print date. And this is printed on the 14th week of 1998. I'm not sure what this tape opens up. Either the MCA Universal Home Video logo or the MCA Home Video logo. I'm going to have to check that out. Anyway, that's the 1990 VHS of Duel. Alright, next tape I'm going to show you guys is a 1996 VHS of How to Make an American Quilt. I only saw a couple of clips on HBO Family. And this is a kind of a, a moving story. It also stars Gene Simmons, Alfie Willard, and Maya Angelou. So, I'm going to have an opportunity to, chance to watch this movie one day this week. Anyway, here's the front, the spine, other spine, the top, and the back. And look at the price says. $99.95? Look at that. My God. That's a, a terrible uh, sticker. But anyway, anyway, this tape is only $0.99. Cents. <clears throat> Not $99.95. That's too much money. Anyway, here's a tape for How to Make an American Quilt with the sticker label. No print date, but printed on the 13th week of 1996. And that's the 1996 VHS of How to Make an American Quilt. And the last VHS I'm going to show you guys is a 2004 VHS of Hellboy. Now, this is a base off 
of a comic book by Dark Horse Comics. And Juan Perlman did a wonderful job playing the superhero. And he also stars Summer Blair as a fire starter. And the Abe Sapien is voice of David Hyde Pierce, which is uncredited. So anyway, here's the front, the spine, other spine, the top, and the back. <clears throat> and here's the tape for Hellboy with the sticker label. No end label, no print date. Printed on the 45th week of 2005. That's a 2004 VHS of Hellboy. Alright, time to move on to the DVDs. And the first VA, I mean DVD release, excuse me, that I picked up, it's a 2004 DVD release of The Terminal. I also have this movie on VHS as well. It stars Tom Hanks as Victor Noworski. He was trying to get into the country or enter the U.S., but unfortunately he cannot go to the country, so he has to stay inside the airport. It also stars Catherine Zeta-Jones. Anyway, here's the front, the spine, and the back. And here's what the DVD looked like. And the print of the blockbuster date says January 1st, 2005. It's a former rental. That's the 2005 DVD release of The Terminal. Next DVD, I'm going to show you guys a 2006 DVD release of Dreamer. Now, I only saw a couple of clips on HBO back in 2008. This is a great movie. I'm also a Dakota Fanny movies. Even though I only own all the Dakota Fanny movies, not some of it, including I Am Sam, Coraline, the Cat in the Hat, Lilo and Stitch 2, Stitch Has a Glitch, and this. This is a great film, and it's inspiringly. Here's the front, the spine, and the back. Inspired by a true story, and here's what the DVD looked like. Kurt Russell plays a dual role in this movie, too. No, actually, Chris Christopherson, excuse me. Oh, I forgot. The War of the World, I also had that movie too as well. That's the 2006 DVD release of Dreamer. The last DVD I'm going to show you guys is a 2007 DVD release of Jump It, Freestyle Edition. This is a great film. I saw the entire movie on at my high school. It stars Corbin Brew from High School Musical and Meet His Neighbor, Mary, played by Kiki Palmer. And he was doing the amazing double Dutch moves and a nice cool music. And he has to um, avoid the bully. So here's the front, the spine, and the back. And here's what the DVD looked like. Okay, that's the 2007 DVD release of Jump It. Alright guys, that's going to take care of my VHS and DVD pickup. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and thanks for watching. Take care everyone.